What is the Greek name that I use for YouTube? Theoria Apophasis. It literally means apophatic synthesis. It takes a long time to explain that. It is literally a means of via negativa, negative dialectic of negation. Um, there is an ancient lost art that I uh, learned of uh, dialectic thought and it's not induction, it's not deduction, it's retroduction. And uh, it's the ancient methodology the uh, Egyptians and the Pythagoreans and the Platonists learned how to deduce things and be able to determine things. It's the same way in photography as it is in people. I mean, if you listen to someone, a lot of people will listen to what someone says. I'm not going to listen to what someone says, I'll listen to what they don't say. You can tell as much from a picture or you can a person by what it doesn't show you as by what it does. The amazing thing in photography is one example that people don't understand is that uh, the mind is uh, incredibly inventive, you know, kind of like vivid dreams. And I don't need all that crap illuminated in a picture. But this particular video is not about photography. <sighs> Deduction. Where was the needle in the haystack? I don't know where you last saw it. I mean, needle's so small, I probably don't... Okay, I'm going to use a metal detector, you know, it's metal, I'm going to find it that way. Okay, that's great. Um, induction. I landed over there, last percent. Okay, fine. Retroduction. Hay is flammable, a needle is metal, I'm going to set a match to the whole damn thing. Poof, it's gone, there's the needle. Boom! It's super fast, super expedient, and it is the metaphysical dialectic of comprehending things. Now, it is true that knowledge is power, but only wisdom is actual strength. Knowledge is power, okay? You could rule the world and, you know, conquer the stock market if you had insight in tomorrow. You know, tomorrow's uh, stock market analysis or tomorrow's news, right? Knowledge is power. Only wisdom is actual strength. Only wisdom is actual strength. That deductive, retroductive, apophatic methodology for discovering things will, I mean, it'll let you conquer and succeed in anything. You see what was lost, and I mentioned this in a prior video, you see if you were a rich person and you wanted your kids to have an awesome education, they didn't teach you, they, you know, your kid was not taught how to memorize shit, you know, or read a bunch of books, although they did do that, like they do today, where you're just taught how to pass tests, you know, learn this crap, memorize this crap, memorize this crap. That doesn't teach anybody anything. That just turns them into another sheep. Bah! Nobody's taught how to think anymore, how to reason, how to actually have an intellect. You know, the person that is taught how to think uh, is far more valuable, even if that person can't read or write, than the person with a college degree that uh, has only been taught how to memorize shit. That person has no capacity to invent, create, to do anything. A creative mind that has been taught how to think is worth a thousand times more than an asshole that just got out of college with a postgraduate degree or... You know, those people are worthless. I mean, doctors kill, uh, the set. doctors uh, and hospitals are the second leading cause, specifically doctors, are the second leading cause of death, right after cancer. I mean, holy shit. So we've really got cancer and we've got the guy with the uh, medical degree. So, so you're, what you're saying here is that people are dying from cancer and the second leading cause of death is an asshole with a doctor's degree. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah, second leading cause of death is an asshole with a doctor's degree. Oh my god, okay, what? Yeah, yeah, okay. You see, they were taught how to memorize crap and they were taught how to do things and uh, yeah, but they really don't have a discriminating intellect of mind to be able to understand things and know what to do and uh, you know, they're taught how to do this crap, but they weren't taught how to think for themselves or why this stuff was important. Knowledge is power, but only wisdom is strength. And teaching kids how to pass tests and to uh, learn algebra and calculus, you know, I'm not anti-math, okay? But let's just face it, 99.9999% of people that were pissing their time away learning calculus and, math, uh, calculus and algebra, they'll never use it again for the rest. You know what would have been really, really, really useful instead of uh, the calculus and the effing algebra? would have actually been to teach how that kid, that kid how to think, how to reason, 
how to engage the dialectic and use like a retroductive apophotic you know I could I'm writing articles about this there's really nothing out there there are a couple things out there by people that I know but they're very very small and they're very very obscure it's called retroduction or apophoticism is via negativa is retroduction it's a lost ancient secret of, uh, of true strength of intellectual prowess of how able to uh, you know and if you have that tool in your brain and let's say you've never even looked underneath the hood of a car before if you have that tool in your brain even though a team of engineers took them 10 years to build a car, you, you'd be able to like open up a car and uh, say, you know, this is designed wrong because that goes over there. And then, Literally, I mean, it does that for you w with so many things. I mean, you could be thrown like a, a naked uh, person out into the wild. And if you have that mental ability of uh, apophotic reasoning in your brain, I mean, you can dominate anything, anywhere you are at any time, because nobody else has that skill. It is a lost, ancient skill of intellective comprehension as a methodology. It's not induction, it's not deduction, like Sherlock Holmes, oh, yes, you know, where did you last see uh, Mr. Uh, So-and-so, yes, right, you know. That's something different. Those are also useful, but nothing is as useful as retroductive. And I don't go, don't go looking on uh, Wikipedia or Google for retroduction or apophoticism because you're not going to find much. Because there's not too many people, there's really almost nobody that knows anything about it. But uh, anyway, I thought I'd drop that for you. Bye. <laughs> it's hot out here, the mosquitoes are biting me, man.